was, I was thinking, you know, I'm so why well, I'm so happy to be back here. If you don't mind me saying, is I was leaving because last time I was the first time I was here. I, I mean, I do all these, all the I'm doing Bert, Bert's tomorrow. I, like I love all these guys, but I was when I was taking the Uber home last time. I was pretty really stoned oh, by myself. Oh, we offering you a star. I ain't ta- I ain't touching a star. How about some reefer? I'll take some weed. Yeah, you won't even but, touch it. No, I, 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 I once you Wait, see, how many stars you eat? I, I, whatever you threw at me, I think it was eight. eight. Once you oh, see that, w- once you see that oh, video Jesus of Lee, Christ. once you see that slipping. video of Lee, you ain't touching whatever he's touching. This is we're going deep tonight. He's throwing me two more at the we, moment. Look at look at they just stuck to the table like Spider Man. Go ahead, Lee. Eat Those are yours, Lee. Real quick, like this, no big. You had, you had like three left. I, my three. You had like I two had, and a half. I, I had nine. No, you didn't. I had three. I had two batches. I had two batches of two. And then two batches of three. So what's that? Two and two and three. That's fucking ten. This is twelve. And I had oh a tushy. Here, here. And I ate a one hundred milligram Lee, make sure you're rice krispie treat because I did an extra five minutes of hip escapes today at the YMCA. So fuck you, cocksucker. <laughs> An extra five minutes. Uh, when do you? <sighs> Don't worry about that. Just eat the Christ. fucking stars. I mean, don't ask him. questions. When yeah. was the question? Eat the oh, stars. Don't ask questions. No, but I was making a point here that I was, I was, I was stoned in my Uber home, and um, I was thinking why I dug it so much, and getting to the point we were talking about before, I was like, you know, we don't have Joey Coco Diaz's in Lexington, Kentucky. You know, that I think that's what I dug so much about is like, you know, like doing. I love Bert. I love Tom, but like, I kind of know like those guys. I know like there's no. That's why I'm approving of you moving to Lexington. There's no Lexington needs a Joey Diaz. What would I do? I don't know, but do you brought do, it up on Rogan. Do we do a radio show together in Lexington? Wake up, Lexington. Well, I don't know if I want to move back, but if you move back, I got to move back. We got to yeah, be roommates. Oh my god! Oh if my we could god! Do a radio show with music, <laughs> and then we're doing a radio show in the morning. From yeah, have my have my mom make us dinner. Yeah, yeah, seven thirty, and then from seven thirty on nine. We'll so do for people who don't know, you said on Rogan the other day that you don't want to stick around here too much more. And you're too thinking, much longer. And there's no. two places you're thinking about moving, and and I, I like I stopped in my tracks. Listen, I had my Lexington headphones on. And, you said uh, Colorado, Colorado or Lexington, Lexington, Kentucky, out of nowhere, my hometown. You say you're going to move there. Well, my family, I have family in Paducah, I have family in Nashville, and I have family in uh, Bradford. So the problem is, if we move to Bradford, it's like Puerto Rico. I mean, they barely got electricity. You know what yeah. I'm saying? You go get coffee at the gas station, and it's like, but they got Lee's chicken. So, I'm oh cool yeah, with well, Lee's chicken. Hey, they got Starbucks, and they got a DQ. So I, I'm in the town over, but there's nothing there. I, I have to drive two hours to, to to fly home. Nashville. My niece lives in Nashville, who I oh, love yeah. dearly. So Nashville always. The problem with Nashville is, um, it's just growing so fucking fast. Like, right, it's, it's not fast. like. It's not as expensive, like, to buy a house, it's not as expensive as no, L.A., no, but it's no. fucking closer than you think. No, I know. And then you have but like, Paducah. Paducah's nice, but you could in Lexington, you could buy a mansion for not much. Please. And Lexington is, as soon as I saw the Christian... What is it, what is it about Lexington that you like? In my heart, the calmness. I yeah, like my the, anxiety uh, goes down. Now, that day there, they had stabbed somebody on the other side of town. There's a bad side of town in Lexington. I, I wasn't aware until I watched the news leave. <laughs> What's the matter? You going back to outer did space you, again? Did you put something on that star? I, yes, I, I su- did. What did you put on it? Don't worry about it. You know me. You never trust a Jew with Vaseline on his fingers. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen it happen this fast. You just no, I'm not puke, so. No, no, no. I didn't put nothing on it. What's the matter with you? You're my brother. What am I going to put on it? I don't know. Don't don't worry. I say it didn't fucking. Well, I don't know. I might no. have something left over on my fingers. This God morning. damn it, Joey! <laughs> I would never do that to you. What's yes, you would. Door? What are you talking about? <laughs> you have, they have animated cartoons of them telling you about you switching rappers, which I think should be a federal offense. You want to call the cops? I should, <sighs> but. <laughs> Are you I'm seriously gonna bar? No, I don't think so. Let me explain something to you. Oh don't, even ever, don't, don't even mention calling the cops in front of me. <laughs> I'm 39 episodes in of Hota Hota JJ. Oh my fucking god! I am 39. Look at me. Do I look like I watch TV? I downloaded it for plane rides only and the hotel room. And I'm what, do you, what, 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 do you, what show are you talking? About? It's the show. If you click in Narcos and you look around, there's a bunch of shows <laughs> now. But a friend of mine goes, "Listen, watch that JJ." He was Pablo Escobar's number one Sicario. He killed 250 people and was responsible for 3,000 deaths. And he turned himself in. They gave him seven years. Sammy Gravola is scratching his head going, Jesus fucking Christ. Well, his lawyer 
fucked him over. Uh, is that the right the same show? I think so. I don't know. I'm gonna still. That's the. It one. was like the first episode. Something happened, right? Something that weird happened. Tremendous. I want to watch it now. It's about, but it's in Spanish. That's, uh, I ain't got time for that. Yeah, you got to read the fucking fine print. I don't watch TV to read. <laughs> Me either. It's a nightmare to read it, but I still read it to check up on their Spanish. You know what I'm saying? I don't want them slipping, throwing yeah, shit you know at the Spanish? general public. Yeah, I'm Cuban. Oh yeah, that's right. The Cuban redneck. They got two Cuban restaurants in Lexington. How fucking crazy is that? What restaurants? Can you, can you look them up, Uncle Joey, please? They got. Two, I think I might have to go to Yelp though. Where, where else can I Yelp, go? Google, Google two Cuban Lexington <laughs> Cuban restaurants in Lexington. I feel, I'm sure I've been. Hey, <laughs> there's two Cuban. I, I want restaurants. you to. I want you to go next time you're there to go to Joe Bologna's. I want you to test out. You ever been there, Italian place? Where in town there? In Lexington. Yeah. No, 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 no. It's like an old church. They can. I ain't next to the fucking uh, hotel. Next to the comedy club. Yeah, I've never been to that comedy That club. fucking food in that little restaurant. It was kind of gross, yeah. No. It's, it's good? delicious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The guy took good care. I had, and guess what I had? Something I don't eat anywhere. But the dude goes, bro, people drive me for this shit. And he was absolutely right. Fish and chips. I what? never oh, eat yeah. fish and chips. It was so yummy because huh. sometimes they give Hey, you- is that the place that's got the good biscuits? Yes, next to the fucking whatever's next to yeah, on Broadway. But they, but they bring you biscuits ahead of time. If they want, I told them no bread. I just oh, got the fucking. Shit, yeah, yeah, try those. The fish yeah. and chips was dipped, and it's not that. You ever bite into fish and chips and you get two inches of batter? Yeah. I don't like that. No. I don't like no batter. I like the. They dip it Lee, and it was just crusty around the thing. They, it was like two big sushi sticks of fish and chips. Ooh, nice. mama, with a little side salad. Yeah. As I, like, as I heard happened? you talking about a pizza on. Sounds like you. You know, I don't know New York pizza and all that shit, but I think Joe Bologna's in uh, Lexington. Lexington's real good. I want you to try it next time you're there. It's called, uh, excuse my pronunciation, but Brasabana yeah. and Old San Juan. Look at that. They got two fucking Cuban restaurants well, I think I've been, I in Lexington, Kentucky. One of the restaurants is from a guy that sounds like me because that's how I got turned on to the whole Lexington experience. Was My brother-in-law <laughs> went to Lexington. He called my wife and he goes, we went to a Cuban restaurant. The guy sounds just like Joey. Crazy. I'm going to go. I'm going there. Well, I'm going for Thanksgiving, so I'll, I'll check it out. But it was green. It was beautiful. Yeah, the horse farm. The people farms were very and, nice. Do they have Cuban fried rice? I don't I didn't look at the menu. Here's the deal, bro. You should bring it for a side dish. Here's the deal. And I don't want nobody to get offended here. <laughs> when I go to a town, people will ask me if I want to smoke a joint. People ask me if I want to go to a bar. <clears throat> I'm telling you about America, okay? Wheeler, Walker, I don't want you to get offended. <laughs> Junior. Junior, when I go to any part in the country, people ask me if I want to get high, if I want to do blow. Women act like fucking jerk-offs. They have no respect sometimes, <laughs> even though I'm a fucking dirty old man. Sometimes <laughs> it even shocks me. When I went to Lexington, guess what people were asking me? What's that? If I like to come over to their house and eat dinner. Really? Would I like to come over the house and then mama would... Yeah, they're, they're friendly people. It's a different animal. Listen, people give me their phone numbers going, man, next time you come to Lexington, I got a boat you could stay on. I'll leave you the fuck alone. You know, shit like that that people know in the country say to me. People want to get high. People want to do this in Lexington. People who just listen to a fucking podcast will invite me over to the house for their mama to make a home and brought their mama and good food? to the fucking show. I don't know if it's good food, but... My point is, <laughs> it's always decent. that fucks with guys like mine head. Yeah. Because I've always looked for that. Yeah, because that's what I was saying. Like, you I'm know. Always, did I go to their house? No. I didn't have time. I was only there for three days. But I brought like seven phone numbers home and I stapled them. Just because uh, that's a different feeling, bro. That's old America. Hey, man, you don't need to stay at no hotel. Man, I got a bed. And him and his wife looked at you. We got a bedroom over there. What? Cable TV. Our dumbass kid moved out to fucking Louisville paying rent. You, you know, that type of shit. Yeah, you which, don't get that other place. Which yeah. you look at and you judge at first. You go, what the fuck? And then you go, whoa, 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 wait a second. This is America. Yeah, because that's weird because, you know, that's all I know is, you know, born and raised in Lexington. and uh, So to me, you know, where you're, where you're from, all that New York shit, that, that's the shit that blows me away. I don't even understand it. 
No, you, yeah. it's a different. Imagine, animal. imagine like that where you're talking about with those people with inviting you to dinner and then spending a weekend in New York playing a gig. It's fucking. It's like I'm on Mars.